magnets can be fascinating to play with. They pull certain metal objects through the air and can stick to each other like magic. But how do they work? Magnets are surrounded by an area of force called a magnetic field. Metals like iron and steel are easily pulled toward magnets when they get close enough to these magnetic fields. Giant magnets are even used to lift incredibly heavy loads of these metals. We can't see magnetic fields with our eyes. We can only see their effects. Sprinkle some iron filings around a magnet and you'll see them move into positions along curved lines. These lines show the magnetic field and are centered around the two ends of the magnet. These ends are called a magnet's poles. Magnetic poles are usually referred to as north and south. Poles that are the same push away from each other or repel. Poles that are opposite pull towards each other or attract. These forces can be used to push magnetic objects without touching them or to make them come together with incredible force. Look at those iron filings again. You can see that they are concentrated around the poles where the magnetic field is strongest. The force of a magnetic field gets weaker as you get farther from its poles, which is why magnets have to get close to an object before you see an effect. With all this talk of poles and north and south, you might guess that the Earth itself has a magnetic field. And you'd be right. It's this magnetic field that makes compasses point north. Magnets are used every day in science, medicine, and industry. And now you know more about how they work.